Hey. Hey. I got those parts that you asked for. Oh, great. Well, uh, check back in a few. I'll see what I can do, yeah? Uh, Ricky. Thanks. Yeah, Boozer's one of us. Ricky, I'll, I'll be right there. Deacon out. Hey, someone's at the gate. I know him. Let him in. Okay. Crease there. Okay, got it. Let me secure it in, okay? There you go, that's better. Okay. Hey, brother. Look what oh. Ricky did. What? Made me a new toy. Oh, well, I was all Deacon. <laughs> oh, that's he really, really that. cool, Boozer. Hey, uh, it could have been one of those, yeah. those three goddamn musketeers. Oh, on guard, you fucking that's ripper. Right. Pretty oh, hey. Jesus. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, uh, maybe this hey. wasn't that good of an idea? God damn it. Okay. St. John, you there? It's O'Brien. Hold on. O'Brien, I'm sick of doing your mayor not. Yeah, I, I mean, I have news. Well, then what is it? I need you to do one last job. Were you listening to what I was just saying? I'm done with one this. One more job, then I'll meet you in person, show you what I got. Forget it. Her middle name. It was Irene, right? Sarah, Irene, Whitaker. It's on her admission form. One last job. One last job. I sent you the coordinates. O'Brien out. Hey, you're headed somewhere in a hurry? Yeah. You remember that Nero bastard I told you about, O'Brien? Well, it looks like he's got some news for me, but I gotta do one last job for him first. Yeah. Okay. You should come with me. Yeah? Nah, I... Skizzle's got me on farm duty. Feeding the world one shitty weed at a time. Fuck Skizzle, I'll drop you off right afterward. When's the last time you saw a helicopter? I'll tell him he twisted my arm. Never gets old, <laughs> does it? Headed. Over toward Malakwa Lake. You know where? Yeah, it's just north of the Rogue Tunnel off uh, Waldo Road. So what are we doing there? The Nero Chopper's gonna be on the ground doing whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So O'Brien, he's uh, he's what? Your, your shot caller, handler? No. Jesus, boozer. 
You know why the hell we're out here? Just asking. Seems like he tells you to jump, you ask how high. It's not how it is. So how you holding up? Not bad. Nah, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind working the farm, pulling weeds and shit. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at, uh, by Adrian on the Idaho border. I'd spend summers working the beet fields. Yeah, a little dirt bike I took around on. Where I'm gonna ride. If you're not careful, I'm gonna start calling you Farmer Bill. When we get to that site, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Okay, okay, got it. Stay down, keep my mouth shut, don't get us killed. Hey, thanks for bringing me along, D. It's good to get out again. Even riding bitch, you know? <laughs> yeah. Stay close. Right behind you. Hey, I heard how the LZ's well. locked down. There it is. Move it out. Jesus. Secure the LZ. Let's go. See one of those again. Okay. Let's Here get this I'm... done. All right, now watch. The soldiers come out first. They secure the LZ. And their boy genius, researcher, scientist, whatever the hell, he comes out. He looks around. Whatever science shit they're doing out here. How the hell would I know?
You catch any of that over my radio? That's pretty fucked up. Good taxpayer money, and they're out here collecting freaker shit. Yeah, I told you. Who knows what they're doing, or why? Well, they gotta have a base around here somewhere, right? You try following them? Yeah, but they always disappear over the mountains heading south, and with the highway choked off, I can never get close. Sons of bitches. Seems like they got a lot to answer for. Yeah. Where are we headed now? It's a good question. O'Brien, are you there? Come in, O'Brien. I'm here. Finished? Yeah, it's done. Where am I meeting you? I wasn't expecting you so soon. I'm sending you the coordinates now, but it might take a few minutes to get there. O'Brien out. Jesus, what the hell does he think I've been doing out here? Hey, you're right about one thing. He does sound like an asshole. Wait here. I don't want him getting skittish because I brought someone along. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the bike. I've seen enough Nero assholes for one day. Okay, I'll be back. O'Brien said he had news. He knew her middle name, Irene. She can't be alive. But he's alive. Why not her, huh? There he is. Yo. Shit. Gotta stop doing that. What you got? All right, look. I'm gonna lay it out for you, but it's not good news. I finally found a guy who was willing to do some digging through some files that, we, that they used to keep while they still kept records. Okay, no problem. Right. Anyway, uh, Sarah Whitaker, your wife, was in, admitted to the Camp Mash unit on the South Flats outside of Silver Lake. Uh, according to the records, she was in surgery for six hours and then was moved okay, to... So she uh, survived. The stab wound she survived. Yeah, yeah. According to the records, she made a full recovery. And then she was moved to another camp on the outskirts okay, of the Okay, so, so she could still be alive, even after all this time. She could still be alive. You're saying no. What do you mean no? It was overrun. Everything was overrun. There were no survivors. You survived. They survived. Look, 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 but there was nothing that would have protected that camp, okay? Highway 97 w w w is an artery. Infected freaks poured up from LA, from the Bay Area, from Sacramento. There were thousands and thousands and thousands of them. There was, there was nothing we could do. I get it. So you bugged out. Who did you bring with you? Uh, Nero personnel, some feds, people with clearance. Nero personnel, the soldiers, the guys with the guns? The guys who should have been protecting no, no, the there, civilians. There's nothing that you can do against a horde. Oh, They're no, too strong. I know all They're too about fast. hordes. Oh, I didn't know that there was nothing that we could do. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have brought a few of them with you. You could have saved a few lives. There was no hope. There was no time. There was no room. Okay, we would already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. No, I get it. I'm sorry about your wife. I'm sorry about all of this. But you gotta understand, if you hadn't sent her with me that night, she would have been dead the next morning. You did the right thing. You know, if you had decided to stay, the only thing that would have happened is you'd be dead right alongside her. Don't you think I know that? O'Brien. Thank you for saving her life that night.
So you're sorry. Is that it, O'Brien? You're sorry? Oh, damn it. All things are wasting my goddamn time. Oh, what the hell? Boozer? Boozer? Oh, God damn it, Booze, man. Where the hell did you go? Ah, shit. Ah, right. Booze, man, where the hell did you go? Book tracks. It's gotta be his. Gotta take a... What the hell is this? Which way? Uh, this way. Still there? This is Ricky. Deacon St. John. Uh, yeah, Ricky, I'm here. What's up? Schizo's been asking for you. He said Boozer never showed up for his work duty. I, I was worried. No, look, we're fine. We just had some stuff that we needed to get done. Tell Schizo we'll be back in an hour. Okay. Hey, I'm almost ready to head back out there and fix that transformer. Yeah. Yeah, just the... Great, let me know when. Tell the hot water now. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's that it sounds great. Listen, uh, Ricky, I, I gotta go. All right, Deacon out. <laughs> Deke, over here. Oh, Jesus, Boozer, what the hell? I figured I'd do a little shopping while we were out, and I ran into a pack of rippers hunting dogs. Oh, easy, fella. He's not infected. He's, he's just a dog. They're hunting down and killing healthy dogs. No, just, no, we can't. We can't leave him here, Deke. We just, we can't. We can't do it. Here, here, let me. Jesus, D. It's okay, just... That's it. All right. It's okay, big guy. Rest. You ready? Okay. Yeah. I think that's the last of them. 
Oh, you sound disappointed. I just... I hate those sons of bitches, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, come on. Let's, uh... Let's get the hell out of here. So what the hell happened back there? You seem sort of... I don't know. Like, uh... Like you lost it. Uh, I don't know. I guess I just... I needed some payback for this shit. But, uh... There's never gonna be enough payback, is there? You know? be okay. Yeah, not like I got a choice. Yeah, okay, come on. Hey, how'd it go? Oh, uh, what go? You know, goddamn well, your guy in the spacesuit, what'd he say? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. Hey, come on, goddammit. You really don't want to be doing that right now. Oh, yeah? You think I need more than this to take down your scrawny little ass? Come on, what'd he say? Drop it. Seriously, what happened to Sarah? Huh? Where's your old lady? Where's your old lady? Huh? <laughs> Stay down, brother. <laughs> Had enough? Where's your old lady, Deke? She's dead, Boozer. Sarah's dead. Yeah, and she's been dead a long time. So don't you think that you mourned her long enough? Oh, God. I think... I think that you have a hell of a left hook, asshole. Oh. Yeah, it's the only move I got. <laughs> I gotta get my sorry ass back to work. Camping gonna feed itself. It's the only move I got. Still, I tagged your ass with it three times in a row. Oh, fucking shameful. <laughs> Where are we headed? Back to camp. No, no. I still gotta work a shift. Give me a ride up there. It's it's just north of Sherman's camp. Okay. That night. And there was nothing you or anyone could have done about it. I should have been there. And what good would that have done? Just drop it, it's done. Schizo, you there? Lost Lake Camp, Schizo. Yeah, yeah, what's up? We just had a run in with. Hey, where the hell's your rope? We skipped work duty today. What the hell, man? Would you sh just sh shut up and listen to me? I was giving him a ride to the work site, and we were attacked by rippers. Oh, Jesus. Where? Outside of Rogue Camp. You gotta tell Iron Mike. Carlos is coming, and he is not going to stop. What do you think I've been telling? For months. Yeah, I'll let him know. We're heading toward Tumalo now. Boozer will be at the site in a few minutes. Well, that's great, because he owes the camp another half shift for the work he's missed. Direction of Tumalo, isn't it? We took the scenic route out. Asshole. Goddamn schizo. Come 
on, you guys. Come on, keep working. Keep at it. We don't work, we don't eat. Right already. That's it. Hey. Thanks for the ride. We all start. There you go. Take John to Lost Lake Camp. Come back. Deke, I hear you. Mike, good. Look, Boozer and I, uh, we just had a run-in with Rippers. They... Rippers? God damn it, you boys crossed the Iron Ridge. Deke, I told you. Just listen. Uh, no, Mike. They were here. In... Rogue Camp. Rogue Camp? There were rippers and rope camp. You sure it was rippers? Jesus, Mike. Yeah. They're kind of hard to miss, you know, with the scars and acting crazy, killing anything that moves. All right, just calm down. We got a parlay with Carlos. This gives us heading over to Iron Butte tomorrow. We'll find out what the hell is going on, and then we'll... You're sending Schizo to parlay with Carlos. Jesus, Mike. Don't tell me how to run my camp, Deke. Like I said, my treaty is going to hold Lost Lake out. Now, whatever you say, Mike, whatever you say, Schizo's right. You're going to get everyone killed. <laughs> Again, Cope, you don't know shit. Freaks ain't on anyone's side. And the world, yeah, already belongs to them. What else can I get you? Sure, all right. <laughs> 